My life closed twice before its close, though it remains to see if immortality reveal a third event to me. So huge, so hopeless to conceive as these that twice befell. Parting is all we know of heaven and all we need of hell. Emily Dickinson. Just for people who need to put the kids away for a little bit from the nanny. People that kind of don't even like kids, but have them anyway. Here you go, Grandma. We, you know we had this plan. After nine months, after carrying this baby for nine months, I need a break. I need to get away. Uh, so oh, man. Okay, I can see the problem was that kid's caught coming down the block. It's <laughs> pretty much. He's fucked. He's fucked. Yeah, she's fucked. Whatever. I've had I've, nine months is long enough. I need a break from the pastor. <laughs> and there's this turtle that was like upside down. Uh-huh. And uh, it couldn't. Couldn't quite figure out what, you know, what the fuck was going on. <laughs> I took us, got down on the rocks and took a stick and tried to flip it over. And there's some kind of nick wire stuck to it. it had like this slime shit algae on the back of the turtle shell. And it, like, this wire was stuck up on the motherfucker. And it, it couldn't get up straight. And it was like dunking on the water. Had to, uh, Take the wire off? Yeah, pulled it out. On the he swam away, liberated. Like, cool, dude. That All right, cool. man. There's a good creek story for you. Liberation. There's a rabbit over there. Where? Where? Oh, oh yeah, let me get him. When's the last time you seen Larry? time I saw him, he was walking down Randolph Road over near like the mental health clinic. Some bikes coming out. I didn't ask my neighbor. She's a emergency room physician there. Really? And she knows him well. <laughs> they have a rapport. He's uh, a regular. Yeah. <laughs> Has been. Chilly One day we'll run into him. Chilly Willie is what they call him. He calls himself. But Larry, he's lied to us for years. There's like a few people he tells his name is Larry to, but everybody else is in this Chilly Willie. It's really funny. And I met him with his wife when it's you. He had a wife, and they were like this homeless couple, and then a drunk driver hit her and killed her. Isn't that kind of ironic in a way? Matter of fact about it, but he could tell it hurt him. But when I felt what he told me that, because I ran into him one time, I hadn't seen him in a while, and he was telling me, he said, oh, I haven't seen you since my wife died. She didn't get, whoever hit her didn't get no time in prison. I guess, oh, I, I guess killer. homeless people. You hit a bum, ain't worth as yeah, much. Homeless people don't count. Mm -hmm. Is that what he said? Yeah. Nick. <laughs> a little too true there. Uh -huh. See, there was an article in the paper about him. Larry Chili Willie and how much he's cost the city in being incarcerated. How many times he has been locked up. It was pretty funny. There was that article and of course half of Charlotte knows him. Everybody in Millworth knows him, knows he's who he is. Yeah. And uh, there was a in that article and there are all these people that this, it created. <laughs> hey, how's it going? 
this huge anti-chilly willy backlash. Like, <laughs> it's like the, <laughs> the vigilante group, you know, like, get him. <laughs> like, you guys who own different stores and restaurants up on these boulevards. He had not hard work. He comes in there and he said he'll come in and harass my customers for food. And when I tell him I'll give him a job, if he, I got some work for him, if he wants to get some deed, he'll tell me I don't want a damn job. I want a hamburger. <laughs> <laughs> but he hasn't been around in a while. And people laugh, you know, you'll be you'll see somebody in the neighborhood talking, hey, you haven't seen Willie in a while. Have you ever seen some chili Willie lately? What's he up to? <laughs> Where's he been? Hope you made it through the winter. <laughs> right. Unlike my cousin Will, speaking of chili Willies, he was among the ranks, right? Yeah. He was a Charlotte homeless cat. Yeah, the water looks mighty clean compared to the old days. Nice. Yeah, it's pretty. They what? No fish kills lately. Oh, you mean just die off? <laughs> just yeah, last year. On the, on yeah, the, last year they were right about here. I guess this was this it. One of these working on the house back there because they're working on the parking deck, pressure washing the parking deck to clean it, mm -hmm. and this company used like the wrong. Uh, Acidic cleaner to be, or that not that should not have been discharged into the water. Some weird enzymes. Some weird. It was, a, it was too acidic. Commercial. It was like a, you know, it was a muratic acid or something in this, mm. or something in this concrete cleaner to spray wash it. Concrete. Ah. It got in there and it changed the. It just totally fucked the pH balance in the water, and it was so low. The water was so low there wasn't enough oxygen to dilute it. You know, the, enough water moving to dilute it. So uh -huh. The water and fucking killed. Fish. Yeah, thousands and thousands. And what and what they do and how they pay for that? They're supposed to be paid, I forgot. That's where the rubber hits the road. But usually in conservative places they'll basically just say, Oh, it's okay. It, I think it started out regulation is not cool. It started out being they were fined like fourteen grand or something and then people were like, That's bullshit. And Good for them. But who knows if they'll ever pay it or what the right. You know, and they had to clean it up. They could That's that good. Nasty. Yeah, I came down yeah, down here one morning, and uh, basically, uh, Saturday morning, and this woman was like, there was a guy with a camera, and this talking to this woman, and she's like, uh, don't let your dog, something about the dog, I thought she was freaking out, and she's basically, she's like, right near the water, there's something in the water, it's gonna kill everything. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I looked down, and it was just like, fish. There were so many, like it just they just started i mean it hadn't been too long because they hadn't even started to float up to the top somewhere but they just like the bottom of the tree it was just like dead fish mm -hmm. yeah. and what about the i mean the other wildlife the turtles stuff like that yeah, they, they all got that kind of shit got away it's pretty That's interesting good. too you could tell there was a zone where coming from down here there would be fish and then all of a sudden there was like no just water you know, with nothing in it, living or dead, it didn't like dead. So, man, that shit fires me up. Oh yeah, Peter. Yeah. And they're closing the bushes right up there, right up there. So that might be another one reason why you don't see chili real Come here, baby. Check this out. Yes. Uh, I've never been this far. Oh, look at that dragonfly. 